Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna be comparing those Cherry Bomb Turbo Mufflers to the Flowmaster 40 Series. So let's get into it. Now the test subject for today's video is gonna be based on my 1968 Dodge Dart GT Convertible. I picked this up from a junkyard last year, already came equipped with a 318 Magnum motor, but it still had 340 HP exhaust manifolds. Last year, I completely tore apart the top end for a YouTube drag challenge. I took the camshaft over to Crower Cams. I got a stage one regrind. I even poured it and polished the heads to the best of my ability, at least of what I could do with a Dremel tool in my garage. I completely resealed the entire top end of the motor with new gaskets, just factory replacements, so the same compression ratio. I topped it off with an Edelbrock air gap and 650 carburetor. And this is what it sounds like. Now, price-wise, the Cherry Bombs are running about 50 bucks a pop, so 100 bucks for both. The Flowmasters, they're about $100 each. So really, your Delta is only 100 bucks between the two different types. In person, while they both kind of sound decent, the Flowmasters are a lot deeper of a rumble, and it definitely matches the personality of the car. The Cherry Bombs can kind of be misunderstood as, as a stock-type muffler. It sounds decent, but maybe that's just because of the cam and a couple things within the engine. I would definitely recommend the Flowmaster 40 Series. It's a staple. Most guys have, have dealt with it or owned 40 Series mufflers before. Uh, that's what I'm keeping on here. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you've got any suggestions about different tests or different angles, let me know. But Flowmaster 40 Series win this one, in my opinion.